Hey everyone! Welcome back to Awesomer Kids! Today I'm super excited to bring you this Minnie Mouse cash register. How cute is this little pink cash register? It makes noises and everything. See, you can try it out before even opening it. Here's everything taken out of the box. It comes with one Minnie Mouse credit card, some cash that has Daisy and Minnie on it. There's one, five, 10, and 20. It also comes with coins. We have five, 10, and 25 cents. Up here is where it's supposed to show us the numbers we're pressing in, but unfortunately, it permanently says 9.99. See, nothing changes. And I guess that's good if you're buying something over 9.99. Can you say discount? And this bow button up here is how Minnie talks. Isn't this fun? It sure is. You can always find what you need in Minnie's boutique. Aw, oh, thanks. I love shopping with you. Samesies. Hi there. It's me, Minnie Mouse. Hello, Minnie. Oh, my. What a good choice. Thank you. I love all the noises the set makes. I just wish it actually had a working calculator. When you press the total button, the register opens up. The same thing happens when you twist this key up here. The register is empty right now, but just wait till we sell some stuff. On the right here, we have a scanner. It doesn't make noises, but at least there's a button, and it's really cute. Think positive, people. On the left side is the conveyor belt where customers put their items on. Let's ring up some stuff. You can always find what you need in mini Look at this basket full of surprise toys. First toy we have is a Minecraft toy. That's two dollars. Whoa! The next item is a Nintendo surprise box. That's a little more expensive. It's three dollars. Ooh! Check out this My Little Pony mini light. That's $3.50. Cool! A DC Comics surprise keychain. That's $5. And the last item I have is a mini Mixie Q. That's $2. That brings the total to $15.50. Here's a credit card for payment. All right, time for the best part. Let's open up the surprise toys. I'll start with the My Little Pony micro light. These are super awesome because they really light up. And don't worry, the batteries come included. Oh, we got Fluttershy. How cute does she look? When you squeeze her, it turns on the light at the bottom. Watch your eyes, everyone! For my next surprise, we have a Nintendo surprise box. The side of the box shows us some different options we could possibly get. I wonder what's inside. Oh, what is this? There's the face. It's Bullet Bill. Looks like he's in a pretty serious mood. He's got his eye locked on something. Catch you later, Bullet Bill. The next surprise box is my mini Mixie queue. There are two surprise figures in this. Two for the price of one. This paper shows us all the options we could get. See how they're grouped together? The groups are brave, sweet, friendly, smart. And let's check out the other side too. We have Bubbly, Wild, Sassy, and Zanny. Let's find out which ones we got. Oh, cute! 
You can either keep them with short hair or attach on their longer hair. Let's put on their outfits. Both of the girls I got are from the smart group. The left is London and the right is Mod Girl. Time to find out which keychain we got from the DC Comics prize bag. The back shows you all of the options. Well, mine is two because those are exclusive surprises. Super rare. No way! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh! We got one of the rare ones I was just telling you about. Look how cool this Superman is! He's all gold everything! Wow, I've never gotten an exclusive from one of these bags! Today is my lucky day, and I'm glad you guys were here to share it with me! The last surprise I have is a Minecraft minifigure! Again, the sides show you some options. I personally hope we get the chicken. We got the zombie pig man. This one is awesome! These guys are common neutral mobs and they live in the nethers. Well, I'm so sad the surprises are coming to an end. Just kidding! Surprise! The surprises aren't over yet because I decided since we did a mini cash register, we should do this mini play doh kit too. I almost fooled you, huh? This set lets us stamp, cut, and decorate some mini bows. I can't wait to play with this. I love Play-Doh! Let's open it up! Here's a Play-Doh knife. A bow cutter. Here's another bow cutter. This stamp has two different bows on it. Here's an extruder. And for our Play-Doh, we have pink Funfetti colored and purple. Let's roll out some pink first. Unfortunately, this set didn't come with a roller, but I have one I can use from a different set. Now press down the bow cutter. And here's the first part of my bow. Let's roll out some purple Play-Doh next. I'll use the smaller cutter for this one. And now I'll roll out a little bit of pink Play-Doh for the stamp. I'll use this side first. You just turn the one you want to use to the bottom and then press down. Let's start decorating the bow. I'll put down the pink, now purple, pink, and then I'll add some little pink dots for detail. Let's make another one. I'll start with purple this time. Now for pink.
Let's use purple for the stamp. I turn the stamp to the other side to make a different bow. Let's layer it up. Awesome! How about we use the extruder to make some ribbons for the bow? I'll use pink. And to make the ribbon effect, all you do is fold it up a little bit. Let's attach it to the bow. How pretty! I love how this one turned out. And here's a look at everything I played with today. Well, this was a lot of fun, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe to see more. Thanks!